Look at this. Holy shit. We got a prelude in here. All right, guys, today I'm out of the junkyard. Just gonna walk around, take a look. Oh, I'll be damned. Black Prelude. Check it out. Wow. Manual. Pretty much the whole front end is gone. The bumper, the impact, bar, rebar, headlamp. Wow. Tires are gone, rims. Shit. All the good stuff. No, seats are nice. It's mint. Oh my god. Cluster, the dash, control panel is gone. Door panel still there. Speaker handles inside, outside. Wow. Crazy. The hood. And the trunk are gone. Oh, and the trunk is right there. Tail lights are still there. Yeah. Yeah, you see Bondo right there. Wow. This is crazy. Oh, look at that. Well, all the good stuff is gone except the seats are nice, still in mint condition. Steering wheel. Wow. Shut that down. Let's go back to the engine bay here. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, the engine has never been touched. Oil leak, common oil leak. That's the distributor seal or the caps, end caps on the end of the cam. Intake's gone. Wow. Yeah, not bad. Oh, yeah. Dent right there. Yeah, dent right there. Oh, look at this one. Look at this. Look at this. Wow, look at that. What is that? What brand you think that is, guys? Holy shit. That's a Yunaka. Yeah, that's a Yunaka exhaust. Those are like three to five hundred bucks. All the way to the middle and then cut right on the front I'm gonna take that with me those are expensive parts I believe those are the most expensive parts on this car is that exhaust it's gonna be a cat back exhaust I'm gonna take those all right here we go guys yeah, so after I use uh, penetrating fluid and uh, pry bar Spray penetrate fluid on those rubber hangers and then after prying, look at this, just drop right in. So I had to uh, unhook the rubber on this side and then in the middle and the one on the end. So this needs to come out easy now. All right guys, so plan B, I had to bust up this uh, angle grinder yeah, I had to cut those two bolts right there because uh, this whole thing, I'm trying to move this thing around and then just won't budge because it's pinched with the weight of the vehicle to that crossbar, that beam right there. So I'm going to have to come back and get a jack. Uh, so, But the main thing is I got this uh, exhaust right here. all about that name so let's take this back in and then see how much it's gonna cost and then I'll come back next time for that mid pipe it's not it's not a big deal no one's gonna steal those mid pipe um, come back next week because that's the only day off I got so all right let's go inside 
So it was a nice little treat coming in here because every time when I come in, sometimes, not every time, but once in a while, I found uh, <laughs> this two piece right here, this tools, side cutter and a crescent wrench. You can see that's still kind of covered with the rust. It was sitting on top of the hood, that vehicle over there. It's so weird how they just put it on top of the hood. So I was gonna look look around, make sure nobody's working on that vehicle. And then yeah, been about 10 minutes and then I just took it, grabbed it. So yeah, another uh, collection tools in my bin. So it was a nice little treat. All right guys, after paying for this piece, back of the GMC terrain now, we're about to go. So before I close this video, so, I ended up paying 35 bucks for this exhaust uh, muffler right here. It's not bad. I'm gonna have to uh, clean this up, polish it down, especially the tip. We're gonna polish it down, and then we're gonna spray that heat resistant, uh, that gray silver color, high temp. So 35 bucks for these plus tax, and then the mid pipe he said is about 20. 55 bucks not bad I guess in comparing to like a brand new one that is like over 300 bucks all right that's it guys thanks for watching